Hi, welcome to my video. So, you've lost your IMEI, so you may have done a, a factory reset or you've installed a new ROM and for whatever reason your IMEI is shown is invalid. Um, so in here I've got a, a dummy IMEI in the top and an invalid one for my second IMEI. So, I'm going to show you how to maybe restore it. Now you need to get into what's called engineer mode. Now there's many ways of doing it but one way is to input a code now the code for this phone is this code but your code might be different so you need to look that up on the internet okay so once in there your menu might be slightly different but what we're looking for is connectivity and then down to CDS information then radio information now to adjust sim 1 you go to ra uh, uh, phone 1 and to adjust sim 2 you go to phone 2 sim 2 is the one I want to adjust because that's the one that's shown invalid so I'll need to um, get into this menu here now you see 80 plus up there I'm gonna just go after the plus and just put an E now when we're in sim 1 we want the top function you'll see a menu come up we want the EGMR 17 but for sim 2 we want the EGMR 110 but you must make sure you're in phone 2 remember when, when, when we went back if I go back one, once more time if we're doing sim 2 make sure you're in phone 2 if you're doing sim 1 make sure you're in sim 1 but on this one we're doing phone 2 sim 2 so here type in the E and we want to do that there okay the 110 now then we want to go in between those quotation marks you can see in between those quotation marks so I have to be careful and get right in between okay so once in between that quotation mark I can put my numbers in now a sim number IMEI number it's 15 numbers if you put more than that or less than that it won't work so I'm gonna put in 15 numbers and you must make sure it is your IMEI number you're using because um, it's not really uh, legal for you to use somebody else's uh, IMEI number you must use your own IMEI number okay so once there we've put our IMEI number in we're just going to do the send 80 command now I want to show you something quickly you see down here it says command is not allowed let's do that again so you can see it command not not allowed in user build that's because I need a space now you'll get that and you need to put the space now just before the 80 and the plus or after even I need to put a space between the plus and the E so I'll just do that now now if I press the send 80 command 80 command is M sent so that's work now so make sure you have that space in in there and then it should work fine so now we need to reboot the phone and we'll see if the IMEI number has stuck There we are. You can see that IMEI number I've put in. Both dummy IMEI numbers, by the way, have stuck. So that's how you restore your IMEI um, with this method. I hope this has helped you. And um, thanks for watching the video. Please share and subscribe to my videos. Many thanks.